Hey everybody, this look is going to be inspired by Angelina Jolie from the movie Wanted, uh, the part where she's in the supermarket getting West Wing and she's just kind of staring at him. Um, I'll put a picture to the link where I got the inspiration from. I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, Angelina Jolie's face is not perfect. You can see her skin coming through in the picture. So I'm just going to use a tint and moisturizer. This is by Prescriptives. seem really red it's because I did another tutorial before I did this one and the eye makeup remover always seems to irritate my eyes so therefore they are red this entire look is the eye makeup so that is what I'm gonna focus on from my Urban Decay volume 2 book of shadow palette I'm working with one eyeshadow today so this is a really simple look but it is time consuming. I'm gonna take Perversion, which is the black in the palette, and it's not really matte, it's more of a satin color, so that will make it really easy to blend. I'm gonna take, ooh, I think this is a 242 MAC brush, my number is worn off on it. So I'm picking up that black. I'm gonna start by pushing this color right next to the lashes. You're going to need a lot of blending brushes if you're going to attempt this look. I hope you would, but I'm letting you know I'm going to have to have a lot of blending brushes on hand to do this. Pushing that color. You're probably going to use about three blending brushes in this, so you have to have a lot. So taking that 227, I'm going to start to blend that top line of color. is easy makeup but still difficult at the same time because of the blending that you have to do but the look isn't supposed to be perfect it's supposed to look a little bit messy and unkept that one blended away really quickly so going back with the perversion And I'm starting to really work that color up to the brow. Now don't worry, we're going to put another a different color underneath the brow bone. So if you take it up too high, not a big deal. do next okay still working that 242 picking up the black and I'm gonna start to wing the color out a little bit and I'm gonna slightly wing the socket line taking a new 217 now Now I'm going to go in with 
Max Vanilla Eyeshadow and a 227 brush. Pushing that right underneath the brow bone where your normal highlight would go. Another clean blending brush, 222. There's nothing on this. Just starting to merge the two colors together. Back in with the perversion. You still have to keep building the color because with black it can look patchy. should be. Okay, I'm going to clean up a little bit. I'm going to take my Neutrogena concealer. This is the Mineral Shears. And what color is this? Fair, number five. on very lightly because this look is not about perfection. Just gonna cover up a okay. I'm going in with a 214 smudger brush from MAC. Going in with that perversion black. I'm gonna push this right underneath the lower lashes. Almost all the way in. Taking a 219 pencil brush, smudge that. Here I'm going to use L'Oreal's Clean Definition Telescopic in black. I really should have done this step before the eyeliner, but hey, it happens. I'm going to take Max Black Track Fluid Line and using my Louise Young Fine Liner Brush. Look how fine that is. Beautiful. Just so I can see really dark. I'm going to take it a little bit around. It's going to tease with the lashes. This look is so mega black anyway. It would be really hard to see it. But you know it's there. Alright, the picture um, Angelina looks like she doesn't really have anything on her lips as far as lipstick, so I'm going to leave that there. So this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will talk to you later. Bye!